So, what are you three hands gossiping about? Archie's Efron-esque emergence from the chrysalis of puberty. Who wants to tryst in the closet of love first? My vote is A for Archie. Anyone care to second it? Wait, actually... Yes, Andrews, yes! All right. Do, uh... Do you know if the police have any leads? What? No, you ghoul. But it's only a matter of time. And my twin tuition is telling me that's someone we all know. Right. Well, I'm not great at science, but I can take point on this if it's too weird for you. Weird why? Oh. You mean because my brother is being dissected with a blade just like this one? Possibly at this very moment? Don't worry. I'm fine. In fact, I'm amazing. Every corpse has a tale to tell. Now that's an odd combo of people. You, Archie, I'm not the girl who cried gunshot. You believe me, but not even my parents did. I just told the truth. Which is why I want to repay your kindness. Well, Cheryl, truly, that's not why I came forward. Save the aw shucks for Betty. I'm granting you one wish, Archie. Nothing is off the table. Except for my body. Jason would want you to be rewarded. Actually, there is one thing. Archie, if music be the food of love, play on. Play on. Did you know this week's the official start of maple syrup season? I, no, I didn't. Well, it is. And every year we host a tree tapping ceremony, a tradition that honors the Blossom bloodline, our heritage. Sounds cool. It is beyond. It's also... Incredibly exclusive. Family and inner circle only. Want to be my date? The maple tapping something Jason and I have done together since we could walk. It was our extra special thing. But I... I can't face it alone. If you came as my escort, I think I could get through it. Cheryl, I would love to help. But I have a girlfriend. Maybe invite Kevin or Reggie. You don't get it, do you? I don't want Kevin or Reggie. I want you. You defended me to Sheriff Keller when not even my parents would. Never mind, sorry I asked. Hey, Cheryl, hold on. You can do this in your sleep. Forward as a successor. Do you remember what she did at the funeral? Crocodile tears. Hey, will be more. Archie, you don't have to. No, Cheryl loved Jason. What was she meant to do at his funeral? Not cry? And yeah, Jason was on the football team, but Cheryl was at every single game, too, doing as much to help the Bulldogs win as he did. Also 4.0. Also, she has a 4.0 grade point average. If there's one thing that I've learned being in Cheryl's class, it's don't underestimate her. And don't bet against her. Quite the pair. Oh, I'm honored, Mr. Blossom, really, but. But nothing. You have to come. I'm worried you're already in. He'll need a proper suit, don't you think, Daddy? Have my tailor fit you. If that's not a problem. No. No, no. It's just. I'm in Andrews, Mr. Blossom. Like you said, my dad works construction. A fancy banquet's not really our thing. That's precisely why you should come. People like you are the bedrock of our town. They're hard workers. Plus, I need a dance partner. We won't take no for an answer. Aren't you kins? that ran away from the ball, not Prince Charming. Cheryl, I can't do this right now. I'm, I'm leaving. Archie Andrews, 
If you leave, the radiant sun that is the Blossom family stops shining on you. And everything we've given you, including Brandenburg, disappears. Are you sure you want to give that up? Are you sure you want to do that to your dad? Cheryl, I came here as a favor to your mom to help you. <laughs> oh, Archie, don't start lying now. You may not want anything from me, but you do from my mom and dad. That's why you're here. Which means, as much as I want you to be better than everyone else, you're not. You're just like the others. I'm sorry, Cheryl. I can't do this anymore. Goodbye. I don't know everything. The ice woman cometh. Hey, Cheryl? That's amazing. Thank you for coming to the Maple Banquet with me tomorrow. I wanted to give you this. An 84 Les Paul in our signature color. You're welcome. Okay, that's all. I'm going now. My claustrophobia acts up in small houses. See you tomorrow. I ain't no beginner. We born and deep in the two one no, in the two one no. Did you really think you could have a party without inviting moi? Or me? Archie, where do you want the kegs? Better do it, do it. Let's get to it and work. Screw it, one in the kitchen, one in the back. Everyone has their secrets. And we've all done our fair share of sinning. That's one thing my dear brother's death has revealed. So let's play a little game to get those secrets out in the open. left Riverdale like two days later. And let's not forget that Archie was also at Sweetwater that morning. Oh my God, color me shocked. Archie Andrews, is that why you became a mediocre musician overnight? Because you and Miss Forrest were pulling a Mary Kay Letourneau? Don't say anything, Archie, don't.